all-time steals thing, man. You gonna have to get like me last game. <laughs> You're one away from the single game record. Yeah, I didn't know that, but those I don't know if I really consider those real steals. They were kind of falling in my lap, but I'll take it. It was on the box score, so yeah. The right place at the right time. It's got to be. Man. That's what it's about. Yeah, that's what well, I asked. I asked. Uh, Monte, the same thing. When you look at the Big 12 standings, what, what sticks out at you? Um, that, you know, it's still um, there for the taking. Obviously, Kansas is in yeah. a nice lead right now, and Baylor, I mean, is right behind them. Um, you know, so guys are going to have to get a good crack at them in order to, you know, take over the, the, the regular season title. But with that being said, you know, it's so close. Three teams tied for third. If we take care of business, these next two teams will be solidified in that third spot. And, I mean, Baylor and Kansas in the head front, I mean, deepest. Mm -hmm. This conference has been in, um, you know, Coach Prom said this morning, us number one in the RPI as far as the, uh, you know, conference goes. Um, it's a credit to Big 12 in the whole. Monte talked a lot about his minutes. What's it like when he's not on the floor? Do things, does it feel different? Do things change, or what's what's that like when he's on there so much? Um, at times they do. Um, at times, you know, people can get kind of uncharacteristic, including myself, because. You know, as, as ball dominant as he is, uh, you know, that's the best thing for us because he's so secure with it, gets us into offense. And, uh, you know, we kind of play through him when the ball's in his hands. When it's not, um, you know, at times we can get out of whack. But, you know, I got to give a lot of credit to Donovan. Uh, you know, Nick, when he's at the one at times, you know, they have a good uh, feel, um, you know, for controlling tempo. But, I mean, when you don't have a guy like Monte in the game, things do feel a little different. Even when he's on the floor and maybe shifted over to the two, you mentioned you and obviously Donovan able to bring the ball. What does the offense look like or feel like when, when he's on the floor but maybe not initiating it as much? Um, you know, I'd say it's just a little bit more aggressive um, because when Monte has the ball in his hands, we kind of just want to go through offense because, I mean, we don't have to look back twice to the ball getting turned over. Everybody knows that. Um, you know, if I have the ball in my hands, it's, it's either because I'm attacking a transition, um, looking for another guy or finishing at the basket, or, I mean, you know, just, just balling ahead to another guy, and that could be Monte. He's such a, you know, offensive threat to where he can be that guy running the wing. Um, so I think if it's not in his hands, we're just being a little more aggressive because we're trying to get a play that's available at that time rather than slow it down. So that's like more incidental than actually like a game. Well, yeah, percent. yeah, yeah. We want we want the ball in Monte's hands, uh, you know, majority of the time. Again, for obvious reasons, um, you know. But when it's not, it's more. I get the rebound. I can bring yep. it up. You know, I can control. Uh, you know, the offense when the ball is in my hands. But again, we want the ball in Monte's hands at any given moment. What stands out about the Kansas State? Um, you know, they're a heck of a team. Um, you know, they're, they've been a good team. They've had all the right pieces. I just think this year, man, they've really turned it around as far as, you know, having DJ Johnson completely healthy. I think really that's the, the main key. Uh, Wesley at one, dude, him picking up his uh, jump shot, you know, really shooting it decent from this from the three this year makes him a bigger threat. I think, uh, you know, it starts with those two, and then they have a great point guard, uh, you know, who's been running the offense well. And you can't count on Coach Weber, a uh, heck of a coach, been there for a while, man, and knows his stuff, stay true to his system. Those guys are just really getting it done this year. Coach Pro mentioned that the key to truly motivating and connecting with people is, you know, being genuine and not, you know, it's, can you tell, I mean, if somebody tries to motivate by almost like they're reading off a set of notes versus yeah. being genuine? Yeah, no question. Um, you know, and that's that's one thing that I don't really, you know, uh, I'm not too fond of. Um, you know, it doesn't matter who it is. If it's, if it's phony, you know, you can tell. I have to get it. Anybody can. And uh, that's the thing about, you know, building relationships, especially in this business and in this game. There's a lot of people who are going to come at you left and right. Um, fake fans, uh, real fans, you know, friends, fake friends, all the whole nine yards. But you got to be able to see through that. And when someone's genuine and, and genuinely means, you know, well for you, you can tell that. And uh, it's a great feeling when you have people like that in your corner. I think you're shooting 67% from two, most part of the layups. Is that something that you're trying to use to keep people honest? get out on you and you can use that as part of the game? Oh uh, yeah, you know, but it just comes with my expansion of my role. Um, you know, whatever our role I'm in, no matter where I am, I just want to maximize that to its full potential. Um, you know, my previous years, that wasn't my role. We had guys like, you know, George and Abdul who, you know, who could finish at the rim, Jamil. Uh, this year, we don't have that. Um, you know, I have to be a more of an offensive threat. So, I mean, it's something that I could always do. Um, it's just the right time to pull it out, and right now is that time. So, you know, I'm glad uh, the ball's been falling at the rim for me. Next week.